In this video, we're going to talk about the Format Painter. Format Painter is one of my favorite tools in Office. I'm going to show you how to start off with Word. I'll begin with selecting some simple text here. I'll just use this little mini toolbar here to adjust some settings here. Okay, so basically what I want to do is have those settings apply to this paragraph down here, create a parameter query. All I need to do is select my text. I'll be able to click on the format painter and then drag across with the paintbrush over the copy text. Works awesomely. Here we go in PowerPoint where I'm going to apply a picture border style. Click on picture format. I'll go with that. I'd also like to round the corners. So on my picture border, weight more lines is one way I can get there. This is uh, PowerPoint 2013, a little bit different than earlier versions, but nevertheless, we can get to it from the fill in lines option. Under line, we're looking for the join type. I'll change from miter to round and that just made a little rounded area there. Perfect, now I've got what I want. I'm gonna to go to the Home tab and click on this Format Painter. When I do, and go on to Colorado with the paintbrush, which actually you can't see the paintbrush, it's there next to it. It's just one of the limitations in the screenshot demo that I, I'm in right now. Anyway, I'm gonna click on Colorado and I expect to see that border at the point that I've clicked on. Just get one chance if you click on the Format Painter one time. So that's not so effective to keep having to go back and do it. It would have been better, and I'm going to undo that so that um, we're starting all over. It would have been much better, more efficient had I double clicked. And so one of the coolest tricks I know with the Format Painter is uh, double clicking that Format Painter. Here it goes. And then just go to town and just start clicking on all of your images that you want that border style to be appearing. Even if I had other uh, slides in the slide deck here, I could even jump into other slides to take care of that uh, business there. Got to remember to turn off the Format Painter by uh, clicking back on it or hitting the Escape key. Here we go. Let's take a look at Excel, how that can be used. I'll just simply um, click on my Colorado cell here that I like to apply across these other worksheets down below. And again, I've been doing it multiple times, so I'll just double click that format painter. Jump in New Mexico and select New Mexico sales, let go. Looks good. I'll go to Arizona, same thing. And then Utah. Click and drag. Now I'm done, I'll click off of it. And uh, when I'm done, it is exactly, if we go back and look at each of those there. What I was looking for, all right.